So I've got a brand new project I need to do. And it involves this GoPro Hero Session 4. Now what I want to do, I want this mounted as it currently is on the front of my bike, so it's facing me. But I want it on an external power supply. So what we've got to do is, there's the external door. So I need my USB power supply and I need it like that so we can run it off the bike. But obviously this is going to be exposed to the rain. So what I need to do is take the door off. But on these Hero Session 4s, this door is non-removable. Where the Session 5, the door would pop out. So what I've had to do, I've had to it's quite hard to say, I've had to break a little bit of the door hinge. So it still works like that, but what I can do, I can pop the pin out and I can take the door out. So my plan is going to be, we have the USB in there and then I need to fill and waterproof that space where it plugs in and where the memory card is. So, we're going to use the good old Sugru. And I'm going to use the Sugru, I'm going to fit it and mould it round there so it's all waterproof. But what I'm going to need to do is, I've got a 128 gigabyte memory card, so I'm going to put that memory card in here, because obviously once that memory card's in, it's going to be stuck in there. I'm not going to be able to remove it. So I need a big enough memory card. What's going to last? So I'm going to put 128 gig memory card in. We're going to put the power supply in. And then we're going to seal it. And then obviously whenever I need to transfer data or charge it, I just use the lead. And that's permanently fixed. But another problem is that that won't fit. It won't go in. So I'm going to have to put it inside the mount, put the charger in and then seal it right inside this bracket mount. And obviously then all I do is just detach this and I can use this on the selfie stick or just attach it to the bike and that will stay 100% waterproof. So there's a little tip and a hack for the session four that you can get the door off. You have to be a little bit delicate with it because you don't want to completely break the hinge. And if you can see there, I've slightly made a little crack in the hole what holds the pin. So it now allows this side, I haven't. So I slide the pin back in and then that one just slides in enough to hold it in place when it's locked. So I can keep it like that. Oh. we can remove the door completely. So what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna, go and get, I'm gonna clean this up and then we're gonna get the Sugru ready and we're gonna get this sealed and we'll see how it turns out.
There we go. One waterproof, two grooved charge cable. I'm pretty sure I can get that back in the cradle. But I'm going to wait for that to dry first. Leave it for 24 hours. And that should be all done. Let's make sure there's none on the lens. We want that nice and clean. So hopefully that should work. Just smooth that in onto the cable so no water can run inside the cable. And that's now got 128 gigabyte memory card in, external power supply permanently in place, fully waterproof. I now don't have to worry about how long this will last. So we'll cut to when it's dried, it's in the cradle and we'll get it on the bike. Brilliant stuff. <laughs> 